I'm Craig Gansel. I'm the founder and CEO of FarmWave. And FarmWave is an autonomous harvest law system. Really, at the end of the day, it's cameras mounted on the machine, two on the back of the header on each side, and one in the rear of the combine, and it's counting grain. It's counting these losses in real time, 140 times an acre, without stopping. So the ones on the back of the header are looking down at the ground, and the one on the rear of the machine typically is mounted on the axle, pointed upward looking at the chopper spreader area. It's counting those kernels as they are in flight coming out of the back. And then all the math is done, and it tells you about how many bushels per acre you're losing and where it's coming from on the machine in real time. If you make an adjustment to minimize that loss, you then get to see the results immediately without stopping again to get out and see if what you did actually worked. So this is all happening in real time, displaying it for you in the cab. And our customers are seeing a three to eight more bushel per acre increase uh, in corn and beans. And that's equating to anywhere from 70 to $90,000 in additional retained grain, depending on the size of acres that, that you harvest. But uh, it's, it's immediate value. And what we see is all the money that is spent and farmers put into you know, precision planting and putting everything in the ground and their inputs and taking care of it, you don't want to leave anything behind when it comes to harvest season. But we also understand the time it takes to get out and do hand checks. Uh, and a lot of people don't do it for a lot of reasons. Rain's coming, got to get it out of the field. This is an opportunity to do it in real time. Yeah, our ideal customers are, are farmers. Um, and we sell direct to farmers. We're scaling our dealer network this year, but uh, we currently work in corn, beans, and cotton with wheat, canola, barley, and peanuts coming later this year. But we see a lot of uh, potential or possible competitors working in the sprayer area, uh, not too many working in the harvesters. Uh, there are some loss sensors on certain make model harvesters today, but they're really, you know, just sensors that kind of go up and down and tell you that it sees loss, but doesn't really tell you where it's coming from. Um, we've done a lot of other work in AI, and we have a lot of patents in this space, but we're, um, we're probably one of the only ones that I know of really focused on the harvester at the moment. You know, there's been a lot of overpromise and underdeliver in, in ag technology, but technology as a whole. And we've been around for eight and a half years, six years of R&D and two years of prototyping in the field to get this right. Uh, all on our website, there's lots of testimonials and customer success stories, and you can reach out to those people and hear how this has, has truly worked to add value to farmers. That's what we're all about.